right, in one corner, we got well, whatever Nightmare Luffy is, bro. I, I don't even know anymore. Nightmare Luffy versus Ors, but with Gecko Moria inside of Ors. Yeah, I, I can't explain it to you anymore. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. My name is Jack the Buster. I should know me. We have episodes 371 and 372 of our One Piece watch through today. But yes, these bodies who had their shadows taken stuffed about 100 shadows into Luffy to kind of make them hit their own monster and hopefully make him into a monster that is capable of defeating Gecko Moria alongside Ors. We're going to find out if you're new to the channel, drop a sub and hit that big boy bell and let's get started. No way, his neck is stretching now too. Dog, how did he get Luffy's stretching powers? Have the other zombies inherited devil fruit? I guess they haven't gotten any devil fruit zombies. They got Zoro and Sanji who don't have devil fruit powers. Maybe it does develop over time slowly. And that's why Gecko Moria was so lax. He knew it would happen eventually. That's kind of broken. Usopp came yelling into frame. This is beyond science. Okay, that is not like mechanical or anything. He's actually stretching. I thought there was a possibility it was like smoke and mirrors, but no, he's genuinely stretching. Shadow revolution. They're like, that clears nothing up, Gecko. Oh, this brook now? I'll do whatever your body does. So he's moving the shadow? Oh, so he didn't actually get the stretching powers. He's just stretching the shadow itself. Oh. Wait, that's sick, actually. He literally has full control over Orr's body. It's the opposite of common sense. Wait, where did Chopper's cape go? I liked that. Yeah, anything. Wait, anything. His body would just like explode if he stretched like too big or anything. He would, he could like rip it apart. It's just held together by stitches. He's perfectly round. This is Hachi's face. He actually dropped a cigarette. Dog. This is so absurd. His feet are together. Wait, why did he stop? Oh. oh, he's actually disobeying. He's just gonna play it off as him, him buffing Ors. He doesn't want Ors to get mad at him. I'm glad Usopp is has the intuition to realize that. Yeah, no, that's probably what happened. Yeah, he probably just got tricked. Probably yes. You should tell them about Kuma. One million percent. That is dire. They grant him a request. Where did they put Frankie? Oh, they just dragged, dragged him to safety. Let's go, Zoro. Taking charge again, baby. Uh, what is he doing? Are they gonna launch him with the salt? I like Brooks Gusto. What's the thundercloud for? <laughs> what is the but does he have the he has the salt right no he's not holding on to it they're gonna launch him through a, a thunderstorm though like a, like lightning and stuff are they turning him into a weapon oh shoot he's like an electric drill damn that's sick let's go brock now, how much damage does that do though dang he went clean through him do it again baby oh wait Oh. Bones. I wonder how strong Zoro's like demon form would be with with these three blades. You don't you dare touch Brook. Don't you lay a finger on that skeleton. Oh my god. I thought somebody was gonna step in. Wait, Usopp's like reaching in his bag. Somebody get bones. I love Usopp, dude. He's not like faltering at all. He's come so far. And then he just says. Crap! Oh, zoinks. He's the next target he's honing in on. Dog, that like one shots you. That one shots a freaking planet. Oh, wait, did it stop? Wait, the shadow. The shadow messed up. Or Gecko messed up. Oh. Atro Mono? Four hands? Isn't Mono hands? Let's go, Robin! Yes! I mean, the more the sun comes out, yeah, it does affect Sanji and Zoro, but it would also affect Gecko because he wouldn't be able to control the shadow. I feel like it's also bad for him that they're, they might be in sunlight. Well, shadow's on the move. Dude, where's Nightmare Luffy? I want to see him in action. Oh my gosh. You leave her alone. They kind of look like those things from uh, the, uh, the Incredibles. Whenever he's in that room and all the like the black balls start hitting him, like suffocate him. 
the way they perish, bro. It's like little ink splotches. It's growing on me. It's grown on me. Has she used Quattro Mano before? Because it is, it does translate to like just four hands, I think. I'm pretty sure Mano is hand. And Quattro is four. Break is back, Robin. Let's go. It's like snapped his neck. I feel like Robin's a lot more OP than the show lets on. Like she could snap his neck, right? He's right behind me, isn't he? Oh, he's manifesting as the shadow. It's not a shadow anymore. I want to get Kuma's perspective right now of him. Like he just has like a lawn chair set out and he's just like, and he's like writing down notes. He's like, I told him about that, about that one. Doppelman. Okay, they, so they can. He's just like staring at them. Mm. They just swap the hands, Robin. Hurry. Wait, what are those scissors? Oh, they're the ones that he's yoink shadows with. No! Oh no. Wait, Nightmare Luffy. He's gonna come swinging in 100%. Oh, yikes. Wait, she's out now. This is it either two days or until they can wake her up? Dude, yeah, and Sanji and Zoro still don't have theirs. He's gonna absorb it? Oh, he's just saying, I might as well take it myself. Let's go! Let's go! It's the back, baby! Diable Jambe! Right through him, Sanji. Come on! He just breaks off the parts of himself that, that are like getting hit. Yeah. He gets to be so particular with it. I've been waiting for him to use that again. I've been waiting for him to use that again and for Zoro to use his demon form type thing again. He can just like TP back and forth, back and forth. Oris is getting mad. Dude, he is like a little kid. He has to get back. It's been it's been like a whole episode. Yes! Sanji ain't giving up, baby. Breathe a sorti. Hell yeah. I, I want him to use it more casually. Like, it's just such a, a, a dank move, man. It's like the magma around his foot. Now everyone's seen it too. What? He's on oars. Wait, what do you mean searching? Like a wound? Oh. Oh! Oh my gosh, Chopper! Five head! He froze to death. I was always wondering how, how the original Oars actually died if he was a continent puller. A wandering dang, dude. <laughs> yeah, you just work on the weakest point. What? Surely he got down. Okay. Yeah, everybody kind of like pull on their own weight. Oh, shoot. Talk to him. Oh, he just shrunk down. <laughs> Chopper care. Oh, he's got a rumble ball. God dang, my boy. See, they were all like hesitating at first, but the longer the fight's gone on, the more they're like actually just like rotating in and out. That has to do insane damage, man. Like insane. Took like a rumble ball and everything. Oh my gosh! God damn, Chopper buff. Chopper built different. Just gonna slowly tear that arm off. Good thing Brooke hit that arm too. You can even tell the other arm has like veins and stuff still. This one looks just like a, a like a doll kind of. And there's nothing signifying it as a real arm. At least I think. I don't know if I'm looking too much into it. Oh my gosh. He's just gonna fall on them. Oh no, even worse. Oh my god! At every point in this episode when I thought Nightmare Luffy was gonna show up, he just doesn't. It's down to three. Nami, Usopp, Zoro. Because Brooke, Frankie, and Robin have all been taken down. And now Sanji and Chopper. Dog, he's rolling the straw hats. You gotta give Gekko Mori a credit though. Like as goofy as he's acted for most of the arc and as like laid back as he's been, he's putting in the work right now. Like he's standing up for what he said to Kuma about being able to handle the straw hats and take them on. But on the flip side of things, Luffy hasn't been here. So is his true power really being tested? I don't know, let's find out episode 372. Where is Luffy? Like the way that Gekko Mori just chills there. He just kind of like sways with him. I think Zoro still got a little bit of juice in the tank, to be honest. He had his fight with Ryuma and stuff, but he still wants to kind of test his sword, his new blade. I'm proud of the teamwork I've seen in this fight against Zoro's, as long as it's gone on. Phoenix again? Oh my god, he headbutt him! Oh no. Oh no. 
He's so fast. He's like playing mini games, trying to dodge his fists. He already took like a pretty bad one. Usopp's got it again. So they still haven't used the salt. Does he have the salt in it? I mean, Brooke brought it for a reason. The sun is rising. The thing is, they were trying to weaken him to get the salt in easier, I'm assuming, but it's just so roundabout. They've lost too many of them. What? <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, shoot. It's inherently Luffy looking back at him. Zoro popping off. He's trying to get in his head. He already kind of is in, in Gecko Moria's head. Wait, he actually tested Orr's ego. He's, at, he's making Orr's act without Gecko Moria. Oh, my God. It's so cool when he chooses, bro. Oh, is he running up him? Where is he? Even I lost him. He punched that hard? Go, Zoro! Oh my gosh. Oh, this is like little crow feet? That was sick. You think Zoro's fast? Oh, Jesus! Oh my gosh, like he can like, hit like, like a plane, bro. Come on, Usopp! Come on! Yes, it is the Oh! Oh! Surely that's enough. It literally has to be enough. The giant bag! Usopp popping off, man. Zoro did, but now he's dead. Did you? Oh my gosh, it didn't work. There's no way. There is no way. Is Orr's different? Oh wait, he seems mad. Wait, maybe it just takes a little bit to kick in. Hell yeah, you did it, Usopp, you beast! And Nami's the only one to know what's going on. Like, everybody else is unconscious. Oh, she doesn't know, yeah. But it's not... Oh, wait. Oh my gosh, yes! There's no way Gecko pulls some crazy BS, right? There's no way. It's leaving. I cannot believe Usopp actually did it. I'm so proud of that boy. He's come so far. Why did the music stop? There is no way he caught it. Oh my gosh. They have the salt now. Bro just left his shadow in, in, in Orr's throat. Just sitting there waiting for the salt to come in. Whoa, wait, he's actually giving it back? Oh, it exploded. Okay, never mind. And he knocked out Usopp. Nami is literally the only one left. Oh no, he's awake. Oh, that blows. Seems so futile. Usopp's like, even though everything seemingly went right, it didn't work out. Damn. Oh my god. Oh my god! But oh, he's killing Usopp! They actually got rolled. Like, rolled, smoked the whole nine. All of them. Kuma's probably watching right now like, wow. But Luffy still isn't here, man. Wait, is that him? Finally? Dog, you better act now. I swear to God. Eh? The straw hat! <laughs> He actually grabbed them. Oh, thank God. I was like, every bone in Usopp's body is just gone. It's so small on his back. I was even still on. Dude. He looks like that one buff fish from SpongeBob, bro. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Now that I think about it, it's inherently Luffy fighting himself because it's part of him in both. There's a part of him in, in Nightmare Luffy and a part of him in Oars. But I don't know the percentage of him that's even in Nightmare Luffy because there's a hundred souls inside. But it has to be a decent, decent part of him because he, he saved Usopp and Nami like purposefully. But it's also kind of cool because it's the souls that, that Gagamori has taken trying to fight back. It's like he's juiced. Did he catch on? Oh, about putting them in himself? He was given the information and the juice. His hair looks sick, man. Oh my gosh. Yeah, how's this gonna go? Gecko doesn't seem worried at all. All right. Time to see what Nightmare Luffy can do, man. <laughs> Holy sh! Hell yeah. Bro caught his fist. Oh my god. He sent Ors flying. Dog, forget second and third gear. Nightmare Luffy's like a different beast. 
Like no match, no match. He hasn't even used the blade. This form is so cool. He's like the Hulk, man. Oh, he's not letting up. He ain't letting him breathe. We haven't seen Gecko Moria's reaction to like being thrown either. He's just chilling inside. Him. Wait, I think it's the shadow inside him. It would make sense if he swapped, so he's not in danger. But Or's, I, I think Or's going down. Are they looking for the zombies with their shadows? Or oh, the straw hats? Oh yeah, they're still calling him Star of Hope. <laughs> One of them decomposed so quickly. It's cool seeing like the human, human version of Lola. I guess the original Lola. Dude, Oris doesn't even stand a chance. I got, I thought Nightmare Lou would be strong, but like he outmatches him in everything. He's outclassed. Oh my gosh, he didn't swap out. It's ironic because the souls inside these zombies would actually want to return, but they don't know anymore. They've been brainwashed. He is swinging Oris around. God damn. They created that beast. Yeah, he doesn't have it much longer. They said 10 originally, so he's down to two or three, he said. So he needs to take care of it. It's no wonder he didn't waste time. I didn't think about that. The thing is, I don't see Gecko Moria like ever admitting defeat. I feel like he would die before he admitted defeat. <laughs> this entire place is going down. Oh, yep, there he is watching. <laughs> I figured he took a high vantage point to spectate. Now the question is, will he step in if it gets to a certain point or will he just be like, huh, trash and like spit on Gecko and leave and be like, hey, we got another spot to fill back there. That's the thing I'm, I'm kind of worried about. Oh, finally he's using the blade. Oh my God. You're getting clapped. The shadowless people revolted. There's no time. Oh, let's go. Holy. He's got to finish it quick, man. He's going to lose this form. Brother. Oh my God. Gecko Mori is like almost knocked out. He's going to topple the entire place. Dog, Akuma's up there. He's going to throw him right into him. See, but what can Orz not get up from? At what point is he incapacitated? Because they're still not, he, they, they still have to get salt down him. Oh no, he's out of time. Oh no, that has to be enough. That has to be enough. Yeah. The thing is like, it's so sketchy because Kuma's just lurking. Is he like down down? No, cause he has to make Moria give him back, right? I mean, he basically did defeat him though. I mean, we've reached the peak of this arc. I just, I feel like I'm nervous while everybody else is, is out of the loop in terms of the, the full picture here. Nami's the only one that knows. And plus all the Straw Hats are unconscious. So even if Kuma did step in right now, they wouldn't stand a single chance because the only ones even awake are Nami and Usopp. And I, I'm gonna be honest, I wanna have faith in Nami and Usopp, but I don't think they can take on a Warlord all by themselves. The entire Straw Hats got rolled by one, but I mean, I guess he did have oars, but that's, that's another story it's still shady i'm still anxious everybody can celebrate now because this one battle is won but the war is still going on but guys the, i mean this this arc has just been incredible i've been enjoying it so so much that has been it for episodes 371 372 of our one piece watch through do drop a sub on the channel if you are new and i'll catch you guys in the next one peace peace